worship you. Just 
Let's begin to thank God for everything. I'm telling you, God shifted some stuff. He shifted some stuff. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. My God, Rabbi. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory unto your name, God. We love you. We love you, God. We praise you, Lord. We magnify you, Lord. Hallelujah. For it's no other like you, God. It's no other like you, God. Yes, Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I don't know what's going on with my speaker. The devil is a liar. He's trying to stay dead for some reason. Yes, Lord, we want the glory. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We want it. We want it. We want it. We want it. Yes. Yes. Give me one second. Be right back. The enemy is trying his best to stop us from getting to worship, but that's not going to happen. One second. Let me try to get this together. I think the enemy just mad. He just mad. That's okay, though. That's okay. We're going to get this. Yes, 
Lord. Yes, Lord. Just invite some people out here. I don't want nobody to miss it when I start praying. So I'm just inviting some people. Yes, God. Yes, yes, God. Yes, yes, God. Hallelujah. God, I worship you, Lord. God, I thank you, Lord. Hallelujah, God. We thank you for who you are, God. We thank you for being Jehovah Rapha. We thank you, Lord, for being Jehovah Shalom. Hallelujah. The great I am. The great I am. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, we thank you, Lord. We bless your holy name. Hallelujah. Yes, God. Hallelujah. Jehovah, we call on your name, Lord. Jehovah. We need you, Lord of Lord, and the King of Kings, the Lord of all of heaven and earth. We call upon you, Lord. We glorify your name, Lord. We welcome him, him, Lord. Hallelujah. We welcome you, Lord. Lord, we thank you. We bless your holy name. We call upon you, God. Thank you for being our 
our Prince of Peace, God. We thank you, Lord God, for the plans that you have for us, God. But sometimes it gets hard, Lord. And sometimes, Lord, we want to just throw in the towel. But we asking you, Lord, to come in, Father, and comfort us, God, because we know with you, Lord, we can get through this. We know with you, Lord, all things are possible in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. If you have a prayer request, put it down. But before I do, I want to pray over special people today. But the Lord is leading into my heart to pray over the ones that has been so given. Father, we thank you tonight. If you're on here now, if you're coming on later, this is for the ones that has given up to me. And God want me to acknowledge you. Hallelujah. Out in the open. And I hear God say, because you have given up to me. Hallelujah, because Lord God, in the name of Jesus, Lord, we just thank you. Because you have given that to me, because you have out of your heart poured into me, you have poured it to the Lord. And I hear God saying that you are, he's going to return it to you a hundredfold. He's going to return it to you a hundredfold. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. He said it's just like sowing a seed. In the name of Jesus, I'm speaking to the ones who have personally given up to me out of the kindness of their heart. God said that he is blessing you a hundredfold for sword and to me. He wants you to know that whatever the prayer request is, he has answered it in the name of Jesus. And I just want to thank God and glorify God for blessing and returning unto you what you have given out unto me in the name of Jesus. So, Father God, we just bless you for that, God. We glorify your name for that, God. In the mighty name of Jesus, hallelujah. And we just bless you, God. We bless you, God. We bless you, Father God. We bless you for the financial breakthrough, God. We bless you, hallelujah, for the healing in the families, God. We bless you for spiritual healing, God. We thank you, God, and glorify your name, hallelujah, God, for uprooting those things that are not like you, God. God is speaking healing today. God is saying, let it go. Let it go. Let it go. I command you to let it go. Break free from it. God is loosing you. If you will receive your healing, God is loosing you from healing. Hallelujah. A rejection. From pain of rejection, God is healing you. He's, hallelujah. He's healing you from heartbreak in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. He's healing you. Hallelujah. From the things of your family and friends. Hallelujah. From the ones that turn their back in the name of Jesus. For the one that slander you. God said, I am healing you. Just receive your healing in the name of Jesus. And be loose right now in the name of Jesus. All of us and one point in my life, hallelujah, where we have dealt with heartache and pain and backstabbing, and it had led us to bitterness in the name of Jesus, and it had led us into unforgiveness, it has led us into, hallelujah, having insecurity, but we bind and break the spirit of insecurity. We bind and break the spirit of bitterness. We bind and break the spirit of unforgiveness right now in the name of Jesus. As I hear the chains falling off in the spirit realm, God said, I'm calling you higher. You have to let it go. Let it go. In the name of Jesus, let it go. Hallelujah. Glory. Rabbi, speak higher about Rabbi Kiyoto. Rabbi. Yes, sometimes we want to hold on. Sometimes we want to blame our past, but we can't hold on. We have to let it go. Hallelujah. For it can't go where God is taking us. We have to 
let it go. Hallelujah. And take our focus. Hallelujah. Of the thing that hurt us. And put our focus on God. And hallelujah. Put our focus on our future. In the name of Jesus. I command. Hallelujah. The enemy to loose your mind right now. In the name of Jesus. I speak fire against it. The Holy Ghost fire. Rabbi Sikiado, the consuming fire in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. I am bow down. Hallelujah. Cast and bind down. Hallelujah. The spirit of ADHD. I cast down. Hallelujah. And break the spirit of poverty in the name of Jesus. Rabbi Sikiado, the and hallelujah, we repent for the spirit of poverty, God, so we can be broken free from it in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. God told me earlier that the spirit of poverty, the root cause of the spirit of poverty, is not only sin, but it's disobedient to his word. Hallelujah. For, for anybody living in the spirit of poverty, Hallelujah. Repent, hallelujah, for not listening to God's word. Hallelujah. Even myself had to repent for sometimes being disobedient. The Lord spoke to me. He said, the spirit of poverty has a root cause of being disobedient. My God, Rabbi, see, I know I'm a higher. Rabbi, them times where we didn't listen, hallelujah, for our directions, those times where we did not listen on which way to go when God tried to speak to us, when he tried to show us, and we threw it off thinking, that it was not God. Rabbi, see, I'm not I'm a higher for I repent for that myself. Because I'm not going to lie. There are times where I, hallelujah, didn't listen to his direction. Hallelujah. Because I want to be broken free from poverty. I want to be broken free from the chains of the enemy. Hallelujah. And I want to inherit the kingdom of God. Rabbi, see, I'm not I'm a higher. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, God, we love you, Lord. We love you, Lord. We bless you, God. Yes, God. Hallelujah. Heal our mind, God. Heal our mind, God. Take away double minus, God. Heal our mind, God. Take away those thoughts that's not of you, God. In the name of Jesus. Some of us, we have thoughts that's not of the Lord. Our mind be racing. Hallelujah. Some of us can't even sleep because our mind is racing. And Lord, we say hallelujah. Heal our mind, God. Hallelujah. Cast down them thoughts in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Bring our mind into the obedience of Christ. Run by Korea by Sianda. For we speak rest in the middle of the night. We speak rest. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus. Glory. I even speak against the spirit of fear. Hallelujah. And I break that spirit in the name of Jesus. For God did not give us the spirit of fear, but that of a sound man, power, and authority and love. In Jesus' mighty name. Hallelujah. If you have a prayer request, if you have a personal prayer request while the Spirit of God is moving, now is the time. Hallelujah. Now is the time. Let me pray over it. Whatever personal request you have, if you want to post it, you can post it. For anybody that's going to come on later and watch the replay, post it in my inbox. I will still pray for you. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus. Glory, my kind We break the spirit of delay right now in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. I decree and declare that our finances will be released. I decree and declare, hallelujah, that our gifts and calling will be released. I decree and declare, hallelujah. Hallelujah. That we'll be approved for that thing we're looking for in the name of Jesus. I decree and declare, hallelujah, a change in our life. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus. Yes, God. 
Yes, God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus. Yes, God. We thank you, Jesus. We thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Yes, God. Yes, God. I see it, Natasha. Just seen it. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Mm -hmm. Father God, in the name of Jesus, I lift up your daughter, Natasha Brown, unto you, Father God. She is praying, Lord God, for a healing and marriage in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah, Lord God. You already said in your word, hallelujah, by, her, by your strife, she is already healed, God. Lord, I am decreeing in the atmosphere, God, and by faith, I am believing that she's already healed, God, that before she even had the chance to type it. God, in the name of Jesus, you are already working on healing her body, God. You are working on, hallelujah, Lord God, the things that, Lord God, you hear in her heart, God, even those unspoken requests, God, in the name of Jesus, Lord, we decree hallelujah, that any affirmity be removed out of her body right now, God, for every pain to be ceased, God, in the name of Jesus, and that you anoint her, God, God, from the crown of her head to the sole of her feet, God, in the name of Jesus, hallelujah, I hear God saying, be healed, Rabbi, for it is already done, hallelujah, God, we just glorify your name for that, Father God, in the mighty name of Jesus, Lord God, I thank you, God, and I bless your name for her healing, and anybody else that needs healing, hallelujah, for in the name of Jesus, it is done, it is so, because you believe it, because you ask for it and you have it in faith in the name of Jesus. Lord, I even pray, hallelujah, for a marriage for her, God. We pray for divine connection, God. We pray for that, hallelujah, that, that marriage, Lord God, like Ruth and Boaz had, Lord God, in the name of Jesus, that you will send her Boaz, God, in the mighty name of Jesus. We are, hallelujah, praying for a holy marriage, God, in the name of Jesus, Lord, I even pray that her husband, Lord, will locate her soon in the name of Jesus. Because I heard locate. So I'm, I'm, I'm praying in the name of Jesus that your husband locate you soon in the name of Jesus. And I even pray, God, that you will place it in her spirit, God, and in her mind that she would know who he is, God, the very first time she even run across him, Lord God, in the name of Jesus, that she would know in her spirit, God, who her husband is, Father God, so she would not be treated. God by the enemy in the name of Jesus so she would not Lord God hallelujah fall for the wrong person God I pray that you hallelujah just put it in her spirit God that when that man come across that you have ordained for her God that she would know in her spirit Father God in the name of Jesus Lord we thank you God in advance for blocking out every false husband in the name of Jesus and that her real husband God will locate her in the name of Jesus, Lord God. I even pray right now, God, hallelujah, for a great marriage. I pray for a godly marriage, God. I pray for understanding and unity in that marriage, God. I pray, Lord God, hallelujah, that they can have a marriage of prayer, that they can have a marriage of trust in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. And I call it done in the name of Jesus that is already so that God God has already taken care of. Hallelujah. 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 Father, I pray for Gabriella Ali, Father God, that she's asking you, God, to tear down the wall of her heart, Father God. Lord, she's asking, hallelujah, for the Holy Spirit to just have his perfect works in her, God. In the name of Jesus. Lord, she needs you, God. Hallelujah. To give her a heart of flesh, God, and to take away the heart of stone, God. In the name of Jesus, so she can walk upright in you, Lord, so she can, hallelujah, be able to move in about the things of you, God, in the name of Jesus, so God, hallelujah, I decree and declare right now, God, that even under the sound of my voice, I'm speaking right now, God, that those chains are falling off of her, God, that she's being healed away from every disappointment, for every pain, from every backstabbing, for every lie, God, 
in the name of Jesus. You are healing her, God. You are healing her heart in the name of Jesus. And I glorify your name, God, that even right now from today, God, she will begin to testify in your name, Lord, on how you changed her heart and how you changed, hallelujah, her mind, God. Hallelujah, in the name of Jesus. So, God, we just thank you right now, God, and we glorify your name for that, God. Hallelujah. We thank you for every testimony that's going to come about, God. Hallelujah, in the name of Jesus, my God. Gabriel, I hear true forgiveness. If you still alone here, Gabriel, let me know. Excuse me out. I hear true forgiveness. Surrender all unto the Lord and have true forgiveness. God said, let it go and let him, hallelujah, do what he needs to do in your heart. He said, give your heart unto him. And don't worry about it. In the name of Jesus. He said, He said, be filled with the Holy Ghost power. He said, receive the Holy Ghost power. Gabriella, God said, receive the Holy Ghost power in the name of Jesus. You still on here, Gabriella. God said, receive the Holy Ghost power in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. He wants to know that fire. That fire that you're going to feel if you haven't already started feeling in your hands and in your ears. That is the Holy Ghost. The Holy Ghost. He said, receive it. Surrender. Allow the Holy Spirit to come on in. Allow the fire of the Holy Ghost power to take over you. Be baptized right now in the name. Be baptized right now, hallelujah, by the Holy Ghost fire in the name of Jesus Christ. Prophetic. He said, Move in the prophetic. Hallelujah. Trust your prophetic instinct. Hallelujah. Trust Gabriella. Your prophetic instinct is what I'm hearing God say. Move in the prophetic. Walk in the spirit. Talk in the spirit. Allow the Spirit of God to take full control. Allow the Holy Ghost to have His perfect works in you. He said, move in the prophetic. Start speaking those things out of your mouth. Hallelujah, because hallelujah, the, the, the tongue holds the power of life and death. You have the power, Gabriella, in your mouth, in your tongue to start changing your situation, to start reversing those curses. To start reversing the things that were spoken over your life. You have that power. My secret rabbi. He said, I gave you a prophetic voice to start reversing those curses. To start speaking over your family life. To start speaking in your animal's life. In the name of Jesus. He said, You have the power. He has given it to you. Hallelujah. So, God, we just thank you right now in the mighty name of Jesus. Hallelujah for what you're doing in Gabrielle's life. We thank you for her prophetic anointing, God. We thank you, Lord. God for the things that you have allowed to speak out of her mouth God hallelujah we thank you Lord God for giving her the power in the name of Jesus to be able to change her situation God in the name of Jesus we thank you Lord God even for her marriage I'm here in marriage for you too Gabriella God said, once you get in that right position, hallelujah, your marriage will be right behind it. He said, mark his words. My court rabbi, Sienna, my higher. You won't have to go looking for it. You won't have to question it when it comes. Because you will know that as soon as you get in the right position, your marriage is coming behind that in the name of Jesus. And I pray also the same for you that God will put in your spirit, hallelujah, to know when you run across your husband. Robo, Sienna, my higher so you will not be deceived, hallelujah, by the enemy. In the mighty name of Jesus, Lord, we just thank you, God. Hallelujah, God. We glorify you, God. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord, God. Hallelujah. 
Hallelujah, God. We thank you, God. We magnify your name. Yes, God. Yes, God. We thank you, Lord. Glory. Hallelujah. Glory. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. And I'm going to say this because God put it in my spirit to speak upon this while I have you on here. Gabriella, it's for Gabriella, but not just for you, Gabriella, but it's for a lot of people that's feeling like you, that has that unspoken prayer request, that don't know how to deal with this situation. I'm going to say this because God has put it in my spirit to say so. Hallelujah. Do not be afraid to go out. Do not be afraid. Hallelujah. Do not be afraid to step out in the things that God has called you for. He said, if you would just take one foot and step out there, if you would just take a leap of faith and just keep going, he said, I myself will finish the work. I myself will give you the tools that you need to be able to move. In the name of Jesus. One second, guys. Okay, hallelujah, my bad about that. But he said, if you would just take a leap of faith and step out, he would do the rest. See, a lot of times the enemy will quickly send a spirit of intimidation or the enemy will quickly send a spirit of fear whenever we want to go out and do the things that God has put in our spirit to do. Whether it's ministering to somebody, whether it's writing a book, whether it's going live or posting a video or ministering to somebody on the streets or wherever you at or whatever it is that, that, that you want to do that God has placed in your spirit. They can not only help you, but can help other people. Whenever we put it in our hearts and in our mind to go forward, the enemy could quickly send out the spirit of intimidation to try to stop you, to try to change your mind. There have been times myself where I could be laying down in the bed at night, planning to go live the next day or planning to do something. And as soon as I try to fall asleep, then all these different thoughts start coming in my head about why should I go live or I mean, why should I go live or anything that can happen when I go live. And even sometimes while I'm live, I have to secretly rebuke the spirit of intimidation and fear because the enemy will try to trick me into believing that I have a reason to be fearful when I'm on live. Robo all about see. So we have to learn that when those thoughts quickly get up in us, when we suddenly feel those, those uh, that, that fear, or when we suddenly have those butterfly feelings in our belly every time we want to get in front of the camera to speak something, or every time we want to minister to somebody, we have to understand that that is the enemy. And we have to cast down that spirit of intimidation really quickly. Because that's not God. God is not going to put those things in us. God is not going to want us to, to step back from doing what we know he wants us to do. So if you feel it in your spirit that God has called you to do something no matter what it is. Hallelujah. Then you go forth and do it. And you crush fear. And you crush intimidation. And you tell the enemy, I don't care what you see in my way. I don't care how you try to put thoughts in my head. I don't care how you try to make me feel, I am going to go forth and I'm going to open my mouth to the people of God and I'm going to speak what thus said the Lord and I'm going to do what God called me to do because not only does my soul depend on it, but other people's soul depend on it and other people's soul depend on my testimony and other people can be set free, healed and delivered because they can see that what God did for me, he could do it for somebody else. In the book, Rabbi Siyanamahaya. Harobo Siki and Araba Hayanabasi. 
So I had to encourage you, Gabriella, and for whoever else that may be dealing with that, to crush it. Crush the servant's head and tell him you are not going to stop doing what you're doing for God. You're going to step out of your comfort zone because I decree it, I declare it over your life that you're going to step out of your comfort zone and you're going to move forward. And I guarantee you when you do, watch how God starts moving in your life. Watch how he begins to shift the atmosphere. Watch how he begins to use you and anoint you for that very thing he called you to do. Watch how he begins to, hallelujah, move you from glory to glory. Hallelujah. Just by being obedient and stepping out in faith and doing those things he called you to do. In the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. God, we just thank you and we bless your holy name for this prayer, God. We thank you and bless your holy name for being here with us, Father God. In the name of Jesus, God, we just love you and we praise you, God. Hallelujah. We glorify you, God, for everything. God, I even glorify you in advance for every prayer answer, God. I glorify you in advance for how you move in their life. I glorify you in advance, God, for their healing. Hallelujah, Lord God, for their marriages, for their finances, for their homes, God. Even as this pandemic moves. Lord God, hallelujah, and many people have, hallelujah, we lost out on a lot, some of us lost jobs, some of us may not be able to pay our bills right now, but hallelujah, I decree and declare, but hallelujah, because God is your father, hallelujah, your bills will be paid, hallelujah, they will be taken care of, you will be taken care of, you should have nothing to worry about, you have nothing to fear, hallelujah, I even hear God right now, my spirit telling me, he's going to send people in your way and I can witness to that and testify that he did the same thing for me this morning he sent somebody my way hallelujah with an unexpected blessing so I'm decreeing that same unexpected blessing in your life hallelujah in the name of Jesus Yes, Lord God, I decree that same unexpected blessings in your life. Hallelujah. As I hear it in my spirit, he's going to send, hallelujah, people your way. They're going to bless you with whatever it is you need. I don't know what you need. I don't know what you're lacking. I don't know how this pandemic has affected you. All I know is that I hear God in my spirit saying that he is going to send people your way. Hallelujah. To be able to bless you with those things. Hallelujah. That you need. Whatever it is. So we just thank God for that. And I'm telling you, just begin to glorify God wherever you at. Even now, even now, wherever you at, begin to worship God. Begin to praise him. Hallelujah, for he is an awesome God. And we all know that God, hallelujah, is going to keep his promises. If he says it's going to be done, it's going to be done. Hallelujah, in the name of Jesus. So just begin to clap your hands, hallelujah, like me, and worship him right now in the name of Jesus. Because we know that it's already done. Hallelujah, that God is going to bring down the heavens for us. Hallelujah. He's going to take care of us in the name of Jesus. So please begin to just worship. Worship wherever you are. Begin to worship God. Begin to worship God. Begin to bless his name in advance for everything. Because God, hallelujah, cannot lie. He already knew what's ahead of us. He already knew this was going to come. He knew what's in the front of us. Hallelujah. So if he said it's done, it is done. Gabriel, I heard next year for you. I heard next year. He said, just hold tight, daughter. I hear next year. As a matter of fact, I hear your husband. I hear you're going to run across your husband next year. He said next year. He said this year he's putting things in order for you. Next year you're going to run across your husband. My God, in the name of Jesus, oh God, we just thank you, God. Hallelujah. We bless your holy name. We bless your precious name, God. Hallelujah. Begin to worship God in the name of Jesus. Worship him. Hallelujah. Worship him. For God does not have to do anything. 
Y'all, every time I think about that, every time I say that, it does something to me. Because don't you know God don't have to do anything for us? He didn't have to wake us up this morning. He didn't have to send people to bless us. He didn't have to bless our finances. He didn't have to pay that bill. He didn't have to heal your heart. He didn't have to bring you out of your situation. He did not have to accept you right by feet. He didn't have to use you. That gift and talent that you had, he didn't have to give it to you. But he chose you anyway because he loves you and because he knows that it's something unique on the inside that he has placed in you. Hallelujah. So Every time I think about that, I just, hallelujah, I glorify God even more in the name of Jesus. And it humbles me even more. And all I can do is say, God, I thank you for choosing me, God. You could have chose somebody else for this path, but you chose me, God. And that's another reason to step on the serpent's hand because God could have chose anybody else. But he chose you. Hallelujah. So we don't have time for no devil in hell. Hallelujah. To try to come and steal, kill, and destroy. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus. Because God didn't have to choose me. He didn't have to wake me up this morning. He didn't have to keep me in my right mind. He didn't have to bless my children. He didn't have to bless my family. He did not have to restore me. He didn't have to heal me. Every time I think about hallelujah where I used to be, I have to glorify God's name because he didn't have to choose me. He didn't have to bring me out. In the name of Jesus. So wherever you at, begin to glorify God's name. Hallelujah. If you can't glorify him for the future, hallelujah, be grateful for where he brought you from. Hallelujah in your past. I can't stop telling my testimony enough about how my face, hallelujah, just four years ago, my face was unrecognizable right there you couldn't see me hallelujah and I couldn't see you cause my eyes were closed and my lip was sealed off the enemy was trying to blind me and he was trying to keep me from speaking God's word but here I am now and I could see clearly robot seek out of my higher and I'm not just saying hallelujah just for the natural but I could see clearly hallelujah in the spirit realm I could speak thus said the Lord hallelujah I can talk to my children. I can worship. Hallelujah. I can praise my Korabah where my mouth was sealed up. Hallelujah. God open it back up for me. Hallelujah. In the natural and in the spirit. God said, if you deny me in front of your friends, I would deny you. Excuse me, y'all. Y'all know I cry a lot. I'm a crier. Remember I told you, prophetic people, we cry anyway. Because we feel everything. Hallelujah. The Lord said, if you deny me in front of my friends, in front of your friends, I would deny you in front of my father. If you deny him in front of your friends, he would deny you in front of his father. My God, right by Sikia, I don't know So, hallelujah. I can't help but 
want to praise him. I don't care who I'm around. I want to praise him. I will go out in the streets and praise him. I will praise him in a grocery store. I will praise him in a schoolyard. I do not care. So I'm saying all that to say this. I don't care who you are around right now. God just open your, answer your prayers. God just open that door. And if you can't praise him for that, praise him for where he brought you from. Hallelujah. You know you wasn't always in that place. Hallelujah. Regardless of what you're going through now, hallelujah. You know that it used to be worse than what it is. Start opening your mouth and praise God. Rabbi Zikiyada, give him the glory he deserves. Hallelujah, for he is worthy of your praise. Rabbi Zikiyada, Rabbi Haya, Rabbi Zikiyada, Rabbi Zika. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. 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 I told you, God said he wants to heal us today. He wants to bring us out of our shell. He wants us to stop being shy. He wants us to stop being scared. Hallelujah. Now is not the time for that. I'm learning this every day. Now is not the time. Hallelujah. To be worried about being shy. Hallelujah. To be worried about what other people think. Hallelujah. I don't care what the neighbors think. I don't care. Hallelujah. What nobody else say. God has been too good to me. Hallelujah. Even in all my falls. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And all my flaws, he still loves me. Every time I mess up, hallelujah, he still loves me. Every time I fall, hallelujah, the short of his glory, he still loves me. Rabbi Fiki, I don't know about He didn't have to love me. He didn't have to choose me. He didn't have to be here. He could have left me where I was when God pulled me out, just like he pulled you out in the name of Jesus. So glorify his name, hallelujah, in the name name of Jesus and begin to worship him. In the name of Jesus. Glory God. Glory in the name of Jesus. Yes God in the name of Jesus. Lord we thank you. We bless you God. We bless you God. We bless you. We thank you for healing God. We thank you for healing. We thank you for uprooting those things that are not like you. Uprooting, hallelujah, depression. We thank you for uprooting, hallelujah, rejection. We thank you for uprooting bitterness. We thank you for uprooting, hallelujah, God. Hallelujah, everything, God. Hallelujah, that this please you, God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah, forgive us, God, if we did anything that displeased you, God. And show us, God, how to please you. Train us, God. Train us, God, on what to say and how to say it. Train us on how to do, God. In the name of Jesus, Lord, we even ask you to train us how to respond to people, God. Hallelujah. And some of us don't know how to respond to people. Hallelujah. We have, hallelujah, their best interest in our heart. But because there are still some things on the inside of us, hallelujah, hallelujah, that needs to be, hallelujah, brought out of us, we respond to people in the wrong way. Hallelujah. So teach us how to respond. Respond to people, God, in the spirit. Hallelujah. And start responding to people in the flesh, God. Hallelujah. Teach us how to, hallelujah, handle things in the spirit. Hallelujah. And stop us from handling things with our emotions, God. Rabbi Siena. We got to stop handling things with our emotions. So, God, teach us, God, how to stop handling things with our emotions, God. And teach us, Lord God, how to handle it with the Spirit, with your Spirit, God. Teach us how to walk upright, God. Teach us how to walk upright, Lord. Hallelujah. If you are able to, just lift your hands with me. I want God to teach us how to walk right. Hallelujah. For we need to be trained. We need to be trained in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. We need to be trained. God, we still have some learning to do. We still have some maturing to do. Even me. Hallelujah. So God, we're giving you permission, God. Use us, God. Use us, God. Have your way with us, God. Lord, I am asking that you close off every doorway. Hallelujah. Every doorway, every porter. Hallelujah. In the name of
of Jesus, close it off, Lord God. Hallelujah. Every door and portal that we may have accidentally opened, God, even the ones we open on purpose, God, hallelujah, of the things that is not of you, God. Hallelujah. Every evil door we open, hallelujah, to the spirit, God. I ask, Lord God, that you close it off and we seal it with the blood of the Lamb, God. Lord, we even come out of agreement with those things that we agree with, God, that we know what was wrong, God. Hallelujah, God. Even those things, God, that was not of you, Lord God, that we might have come into agreement with, Lord God. Hallelujah. I'm asking God to please, hallelujah, bring us out of agreement with that, God. Close that door, God. Hallelujah. And fill it with the blood of the Lamb, God. Close off every evil gateway, God. In the name of Jesus. For we serve an eviction notice to un. Hallelujah for every uninvited. Hallelujah. Spirit, my God, Rabbi CI. We serve an eviction notice. Hallelujah to every uninvited spirit, God. And we send you back unto, hallelujah, the sinner, the sender. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus. Glory, glory. Glory, glory. Hallelujah. 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 Hallelujah, God. I'm going to try my best to end in here. As the Holy Spirit is still moving. Hallelujah. But I'm going to end it here. In the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. And I just decree and declare that you, hallelujah, receive this prayer for your life. I decree and declare, hallelujah, in the name of Jesus, that, hallelujah, that your door, your door will be open. I decree and declare that you shall live and not die. In the name of Jesus, I decree, hallelujah, the works of the Lord in your life. Hallelujah, submit your will to his will. In the name of Jesus, hallelujah. Hallelujah. I speak favor over your life in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. And we plead the blood of Jesus. Hallelujah. Against every backlash. We plead the blood of Jesus against, hallelujah, every backstabber. We plead the blood of Jesus against every retaliation. We plead the blood of Jesus against the spirit of intimidation. We plead the blood of Jesus over the spirit against the spirit of fear. We plead the blood of Jesus, hallelujah, against the spirit of doubt in the name of Jesus, hallelujah. We plead the blood of Jesus, hallelujah, against the enemy right now, hallelujah. We plead the blood of Jesus against the spirit of confusion, and I decree and declare, hallelujah, that you will not be confused. I decree and declare, hallelujah, that you will not be forgetful. I decree and declare that even as you're trying to read the Bible and pray, hallelujah, that you will remain focused. Hallelujah, in the name of Jesus, that you will be able to remain focused. Hallelujah, and we cast out, hallelujah, in the any spirit that may try to intervene what God is doing in your life. In the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. So I love you guys. I'm going to try to end it here. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus. I'm going to try to end it here, guys. Hallelujah. Because my phone is actually going down. <laughs> Hallelujah. But even as I get off this slide, I just want y'all to worship God. Worship Him. Bless Him. Hallelujah. Allow Him to come in and to heal you. Allow Him to come in. Hallelujah. And sit with you. Eat with you. Walk with you and talk with you. God wants to be your friend. He wants to be, hallelujah, your friend. He wants to have that intimate relationship with you. Be cleansed. Be cleansed in the name of Jesus. Be healed in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And walk in your authority. Walk in your God-given authority. Walk in your God-given authority in the name of Jesus. Take back everything that the enemy stole from you. In the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Allow 
hallelujah, God, to have his way with you. Hallelujah. Allow change to come in. Do not fear change. I even hear, do not fear change in the name of Jesus. Don't fear change. I used to fear change. Don't fear change. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Rebel seeking out of my heart. So God bless you guys. I love you. I love you. God bless. And take care. And for whoever that just jumped on, for whoever that's going to watch the replay, please send me your prayer request. Hallelujah. Through my inbox. Even if you want me to get on the phone with you and pray, I am always open for that. I'm also going to try to start back doing the weekly prayer call. Um, unfortunately, something came up with my um, with my conference number. Something came up with my conference number to where I couldn't use it. So I'm working on that right now. And when I do, I'm going to start my weekly prayer calls. So if y'all are able to, I would just like to kind of have an idea of the time zones that everybody is in. So that I'll be able to do the call um, where, where most of y'all, if I can't, everybody can join in. I don't want to try to do the prayer call when it's real late at night for your area and you can't. You don't, I'm sorry guys, join in. I apologize for that. And you can't join in because you're late in the bed because it's late night. So I at least want to try to set up something. And I'm going to try to do this more often too. God is uh, putting in my spirit to do more prayers like this. Also, God is putting in my spirit to do a, a testimony live. So if y'all want to do a testimony live where I, I go live and I try my best to invite you on the live so that, um, so that you can tell your testimony to the world, you know. Uh, please let me know because I'm going to try to set it up as soon as I can. I'm going to try to do the live. So like I said, God bless. I love you guys. For the ones that just got on, please go back and watch from the beginning. This is a powerful prayer of the Lord in the name of Jesus. And I just decree and declare, hallelujah, that y'all are going to have a blessed rest of the uh, weekend. I decree and declare that you have a blessed rest, uh, rest of your week. I even, hallelujah, have faith that, hallelujah, some of y'all will run across your blessing even coming up in this week. Hallelujah, in the name of Jesus, that you're going to run across, hallelujah, some unexpected blessings. I'm telling you, God sent me unexpected blessing this morning and I'm decreeing that same favor over your life that you will receive some unexpected blessings hallelujah for God knows what we need and he already has somebody on the way hallelujah to take care of those needs for you hallelujah so if you're just coming on like I said please go back and watch this powerful prayer from the beginning I love you guys and God bless